स्टार्ट द रिट कोर्ट कैनॉट इश्यू अ डायरेक्शन विच हैज द इफेक्ट ऑफ कॉन्फरिंग ज्यूरिस्डिक्शन अपॉन एन अथॉरिटी विच इज नॉट वेस्टेड इन इट बाय लॉ नॉर कैन इश्यू अ डायरेक्शन सो एज टू डेनाय एक्सरसाइज ऑफ ज्यूरिस्डिक्शन बाय एन अथॉरिटी विच इज सो वेस्टेड इन इट बाय लॉ it is for the legislature to create forum and once such forums have been constituted the writ court would ordinarily not issue a direction permitting a difference course it appears that learned additional advocate general appearing for the state of uttar pradesh being conscious of such statutory scheme has taken the stand before us that a direction could have been issued by the writ court only to the registrar for holding election under section 25 under under bracket 2 of the act and such a direction could not have been issued to the authorized controller for this purpose it is otherwise interesting to note that in the present case the authorized controller has further delegated its power and has directed the sub divisional magistrate to con- conduct election which is even otherwise not permissible in law it is further apparent that competent authorities under the act of 1860 have not yet resolved the issue of membership nor the civil court has ruled on it and therefore to permit the sub divisional magistrate as delegate of the authorized controller to publish election program would amount to elections being rendered a farce para at this stage i may also draw distinction between the authorized controller appointed under the act of 1973 and the authorized controller appointed in respect of educational institutions recognized under the provisions of the up intermediate education act 1921 section 16c of the act of 1921 provides for framing of a scheme of administration to manage an institution section 16d provides that such scheme shall not be inconsistent with third schedule which provides for procedure for constituting the committee of management as per scheme of administration by holding periodical elections the committee of management of the institution is a distinct body the scheme of administration also contain a provisions that in case elections are not held within time the authorized controller shall be appointed who shall get the elections held to constitute the committee of management of the institution para there is a distinction between an educational institution recognized under the act of 1921 as well as an educational institution affiliated to an university incorporated under the act of 1973 in respect of the educational institution recognized under the act of 1921 specific power vests by virtue of scheme of administration in the authorized controller to conduct elections and that is why directions are issued by writ court to the authorized controller to hold election 
The situation is different in respect of an educational institution affiliated to an university incorporated under the Act of 1973. The Act of 1973 does not provide for a separate scheme of administration nor any such scheme has been placed on record conferring jurisdiction upon the authorized controller to hold elections of society for managing the educational institution over